It's one of the world's largest coral systems, made up of nearly 3,000 separate reefs and 900 islands. The Great Barrier Reef attracts huge numbers of tourists every year, but this underwater treasure is at risk of disappearing due to coral bleaching caused by rising temperatures. Over the past two weeks, James Cook University has surveyed more than a 1,000 reefs. It found they were severely bleached in all three regions of the system and says it's more widespread than ever before. This is the third time it's happened in the past five years. If this continues and we're seeing these mass bleaching events every few years, there just will not be the opportunity for the corals to recover in between these major disturbances. When water is too warm, corals will expel algae that causes them to bleach. In February, the reef recorded its highest sea surface temperature since records began in 1900. While bleaching isn't always fatal, scientists say in severe events like this, many corals don't survive. It really is unprecedented. And when we think about what the Great Barrier gives Australia, it's its cultural heritage, it's iconic, um, and the tourism industry, all of these facets we will lose instantly if we have another bleaching event of these magnitudes. The reef is highly vulnerable, not only to warming temperatures, but also pollution and coastal development. Scientists say ocean temperatures over the next month will be crucial to how the reef recovers. It's not just in the sea where Australia is feeling the effects of climate change. Of course, severe drought is intensifying bushfires and scientists are calling for stronger climate policy from the government to reduce emissions. Without it, they say the situation will only get worse. Nicola Gage, Al Jazeera, Sydney.